whoa, whoa, what the heck? Look at this, you guys. I came back after, you know, just going on a nice walk, having a bit of dinner, and decided to check in on our little nichelings in the brand new mobile game for niche, Niche Breed and Evolve. And I stumbled upon the baby. Not only did Lala have her baby with Deer Duke, but the baby is all grown up. Annecy, oh my gosh, look at her. She's got that really beautiful mask patterning, and she has the hooves! Are those so cool? I wish they would add hooves into the computer version of Niche. Oh my gosh, that would be so much fun to be able to see. So let's see. She actually has recessive genes on deformed paw. She also has recessive short-sighted eyes, which is not the best thing in the world. Um, but otherwise, she has medium body, and then she's also got medium tail, and a lot of the normal genes that we're familiar with from our Nicheling adventures on PC too. So, huh, that's kind of cool. Also, we have something glowing here. Let five Nichelings join your pack. Yay, we got some food for that. Send Nichelings on five forging missions. Yay, we got more for that. Oh, look, and it looks like we can have up to 10 Nichelings and give birth to three Nichelings. <gasps> you know what? Let's go ahead and get like a sibling of some kind. Lala, I think I want to... Hmm, what should we try to enforce on Lala? Like having the nimble fingers is really helpful because that gives you more collecting. Ooh, let's go ahead. Goat horns, let's use this. Wait, 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 wait. Let's use a mutagen. Dear Duke also has goat horns. And he did not, did he pass on bunny ears to Annecy? He did not pass on bunny ears. You know what? I want deer bunnies more than anything else. So let's actually gain level two on those bunny ears. And let's actually see if Lala and Deer Duke can have another baby. And let's see if that baby can actually have bunny ears. And we're gonna rename Annecy to Doe. <gasps> Do you remember Doe Lee from our other Nicheling adventures? Heck. But she's definitely gonna be named Doe because her dad is literally named like Deer Duke. Come on, that's kind of cool. And Adam and Eve, can I have them have? Okay, we have to reach level two to unlock it. How do I level up? current level of this island. Oh, so we have to level up the whole island here. <gasps> Do you think we have different nichelings on every island? That would be really interesting. That would be really interesting. World level one. How do you raise the levels on the world? This is going to be so cool to see. All right, so let's go ahead and we're going to grab Lala and we're going to grab Deer Duke and they're going to need 76 food. There we go. And now she is expecting her baby in like three minutes. So we're going to see the newest baby be born pretty soon. I'm glad they don't make you wait forever, like have microtransactions you have to worry about to make the aging process go faster. So while she is going ahead and waiting for the baby to be born, let's actually come over. Adam has good collecting. Eve has good collecting. Doe and Deer Duke have good attack, but they don't have good collecting. So let's see. I'm going to send Deer Duke out. And then we're going to send the party to the clearing. Okay, so Deer Duke is actually really good at hunting. And it looks like hunting is the red icon over here. And collecting is going to be the green icon. So, oh, there's another nicheling over here. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go see who this is. All right, up we go. All right, we managed to go ahead and hunt down that nicheling and then i'm going to move over there we go i'm going to have adam go ahead and dive after is that adam i can't tell like yeah i think that's adam he's gonna go ahead and dive after the food and then we're gonna have eve go ahead and greet the newcomer and we'll have these guys there we go okay so we have a newcomer now all right, I need to scooch her over too. And now, can we get everybody? <gasps> yes, we got them all to the clearing. So we got some bonus food. Nice. A wild nicheling appears. Lamenta wants to join your pack. You can find encountered nichelings to the right border of your meadow. All right, let's go back home. This is interesting because it's so different and we need to wait a few more seconds before we can send anybody else out. And Lamenta, huh? So she actually has derp snout and recessive boar tusks, which is interesting. Blind eye recessive. <laughs> she has long tail and she has moss brown mane. And those are the only new genes that she has. Lamenta, you have really bad genes. We are not gonna be adding you, my dear, unfortunately. 
to our our tribe like I, you can you can stay oh can i gather oh i could gather those some one of you guys told me you could actually gather the berries that are like around your camp to the right and it, it totally was there harvest berry bush one time yay all right that was fun all right so let's see the baby's about to be born everybody's relaxed so let's actually go back out we'll send dear duke and adam and eve out again we'll join the mission all right, looks like we just need to do this. All right, Deirdre goes up. And then, let's see. We'll slide over like this. We should be able to get, yeah, everybody in. And then wiggle everybody down. There we go. Bonus on the food. Nice. We've almost got the clearing all the way up to level one now. Give birth to three nichelings. That means there's a new baby. Let's come. <gasps> Look at this little baby, Cure Duke, and he's got an hour of being a little young one. How cool is that? He's got a new mutagen. He's got his dots everywhere, you guys. Oh, that's so cool. He also has recessive rabbit ears, level two. Oh my goodness, I really wish he would have gotten those rabbit ears. But he he has one nimble finger, and he has recess. Yeah, he's got double nimble fingers and recessive hoof this time. He happens to have a tail. No tail is a possible. Is that a usual mutation? I can't remember if those are some of the genes that you can get elsewhere. So he can do collecting and he also has a little protection against the cold. Good perception and a little bit of attack. All right, and we can actually go ahead and feed him to make him grow up and give him a little pet. There you go, Kira Duke. And he starts at level two because of the genes that we leveled up with him, I think. That is so cool. And do oh, you're so big now. So I think now it's just kind of like sending our nichelings out to the clearing again. Let's send the party back out. All right, oh, there's another nicheling here. Oh man, I wonder if we're gonna be able to meet them. Uh, okay, so let's see. Everybody here can actually do a little bit of collecting and a little bit of fighting. Um, we'll get this group, whoops, oh dear. All right, all right, uh, there we go. We'll get that group up there. Oh man, I'm messing up so bad right now. <laughs> and then we'll need to pull somebody over a couple times. Oh man, okay, I've really messed up a lot. We've met a new nicheling at least. Can I get some food? I can get food! Oh, we just made it! It's kind of a fun little random puzzle, isn't it? Oh, we're level two now! Yay! Because we have brought the region up, so can we come to the forest? The island needs to be level three before we can go to the forest. So we actually need to send more nichelings out. But guess what? We have Deer, Deer Duke and Doe. Both of them don't have any collecting. Heck. And you need just collecting for the flower field because there's no bundles to hunt. Oh. I'm starting to really grasp it, you guys. It's beginning to become clear to me. Can we unlock this nest now? Yes. All right. So we unlocked another nest. We have to reach level four to unlock that nest. So all of that will probably be nichelings in the future. Level three to unlock that one. And Laminta, it was really cool to meet you, but we're gonna have to go ahead and send you away. Because we could have met another new nicheling that could have brought in even more interesting genes. And then what is this with him? Retire. Oh, so you can retire your nichelings when you're ready. Well, that would free up some nest space so we could work on some breeding. But right now, I think we're going to allow Adam and Eve to stick around and maybe have a sibling for Lala. Hmm, that actually sounds like a good idea. Eve, do you want to have a baby? Let's go ahead and have Eve maybe have a baby. Let's check if we have any mutagens we really want to reinforce with her. <sighs> Not really. She does have little goat horns, which do give her a teeny bit of strength. I think I want Adam to maybe pass on nimble fingers. But we're about to go ahead and like have, we're about to go ahead and like have Lala kind of take over the show. But Adam, hmm, do I want to keep him around? I think I'll save the mutagens for the newer nichelings that we'll keep. Let's have Adam and Eve go ahead and have another baby. Because this is the breed and evolve portion of trying to do this. All right. Meanwhile, let's get the flower filled up to another level. Um, we definitely need some collectors <laughs> and Deer Duke is not a collector, but I guess, I guess Doe can go along just to see what her like family does. All right. I already messed up. What? 
All right, gathering food, destroying stuff. Oh, she gathered a little bit of food, even though she didn't really have much. Yay! Okay. Yay, and now we're level three, which means we can go to the forest biome now. <gasps> so we need to have greater attack, and we need to be able to collect and have some perception to be able to get through here. We're now level three, which means I think we can start encountering more new types of nichelings. Let's do it. There we go. Oh, look at that. So wild nests do show up. Okay, so it's just like a totally different... Oh, there's more berries. A totally different kind of nicheling experience than usual. Heck, everybody is ready. So let's go into the forest. We'll take Deer Duke with us. And then we'll take Adam and Lala. And let's see if we have what it takes. <gasps> there's a Berina now! What? Okay, he's level three, but... Deer Duke is going to prove his worth right now because he is level four. We'll go ahead and send Deer Duke up first. Get him, Deer Duke! Yes! All right. Meanwhile. Okay, we're working across the forest. It's a little trickier than I thought it would be, but we're doing okay. All right. And phew, we almost ran out of turns. But we got a little bit of forest food from that and a little bit of forest experience. So forest, each nicheling can collect six food per foraging. You have collected, oh, and you can see how much food you have to collect before you can level up. That's so neat. But good to note that Deer Duke actually just fought off a Barina. Not quite as exciting as when we fight off Barina in the PC game, but it's still there. You do still have to be concerned about your nichelings like survival skills. Let's see, are we about to, oh, we're about to have another baby, yes. And then we need to reach level four to unlock that. So you can have up to 10 nichelings in your tribe, I think. Let's see if we can try to get like some new genetics in here by discovering a new nicheling that we can go ahead and maybe work with or fight with. Doe could actually come on in. Hmm. We'll send to Doe in. We can send them on missions on their own, or we can set up these kinds of missions. All right, Doe, what the heck? I think Doe, there we go. Okay, so like that just literally was not going to work. The other way we had it set up. Oh, cause look, these niche things I see now because their attack is too low, they, they can just like throw themselves into it and get nothing. Oh, so I'm going to have to be really careful with those. Well, let's send Eve and Deer Duke. Because the, the more nichelings we have, the faster we can actually send them out on missions. Got it. And Deer Duke can actually protect Eve this time and take out that Barina. Meanwhile, Eve could potentially... Let's get them up here. And then we're going to have Eve wander this way. There we go. So we got four food from that, and then I accidentally <laughs> ended up passing the other food source. There we go. Okay, and see, just as I wrap up with that, then the other group is ready to go back out again. Nice! So it definitely is absolutely worth it to try to set it up. Oh, I should pull the barina towards them like this. Wait, what just happened? Did we just have a nicheling die? Wait a second. Did Eve just die? Did... Did that really happen? Oh, and now she's in the way. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, we met a new nicheling? We only got four food? A wild nicheling appeared? Alita has joined us? Did I just... Your nicheling got hurt by a predator while forging. You can heal it with the heal button in the detail view. What the heck, Eve? I'm sorry! Are you okay, Eve? Was it Eve who got hurt? Oh my goodness. I, 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 was it Eve who got hurt? No, Eve. Oh, it's Lala. Look, she's actually dripping. Oh my gosh, Lala. So we have to give her like 30 food to heal her or else maybe something bad would have happened. That's terrifying. Also, welcome to little Talur. Look at him, you guys. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Talur, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to name you, um... Let's see, Talon. 
Do you have any talons? Maybe not, kid. He's got two little talons. We'll take it. Uh, I really probably should have reinforced the ability to like have some horns on these guys because I actually am beginning to realize you do have to be a little concerned about what your nichelings are pulling in in order to be able to like add to your tribe and take care of them. Huh. Alrighty. Meanwhile, <gasps> Alita, look at you. She looks so cool. So she has a ton of new jeans, blotches, light green eyes. She's also got dense pattern, very big pattern, very small mask. Um, oh, she's got recessive bird beak. <gasps> okay, I need her in my life. She also has pointy ears and blind eye recessive, which is not something we want for sure. Can we add her? Okay, we need to either send a nicheling away or, oh, 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 the berries are back, got them. We either need to send a nicheling away or we need to go ahead and uh, we, <laughs> we need to like have this nest unlock. So how am I gonna get her into our tribe? Oh, and look at all the little like hooves we've got, but unfortunately the hooves don't really help you a lot when it comes to trying to do everything else with your tribe. Oh, and I love her tail. And can you imagine if we had bird beak? She's got fishing tail and sneaky tail. All right, this is oddly addictive because I forgot how much fun it can be just to have rambling families of nichelings. Uh, so I'm enjoying this. I am. To be honest, it's really inspiring me to get back into the PC version. So definitely keep your eyes out for that, guys. But if you could, do please leave a like for our little baby nichelings. Because I think this is fun enough that we're definitely going to be kind of working on exploring what the other islands have to offer. I have to say I'm feeling pretty proud. We might check out Retirement Island. It looks like it has plenty of space. Plenty of space for everybody. Uh, but yeah, so we'll see. We'll see. So all right, if you guys could, do please leave a like for our little uh, dear Duke Doe nichelings. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.